Hello, we're doing the setting up the Daily Dish Pro theme by Studio Press, and in this video, we're going to set up a section called the Before Footer Featured Post Widget. On the Studio Press uh, site, if you look at the demo for this theme, you'll see six little boxes appear here, and that's what we're going to set up now. So it's in a, a, a widget area called uh, before footer featured posts so what we need to do we need to go to appearance we're going to go to widgets we could do it through the customizer but we're going to go to widgets and we want to look for before footer widgets and we're going to drag a genesis featured posts widget not featured page widget featured posts widget into before footer widgets we'll type a title of featured dishes and we'll choose a category of all categories so to take it from any category we're going to show six posts or six featured images um, we want to show the featured images You've got to have featured images attached to your posts if you want this to work. When you make a post, make sure you click the featured image um, section and add an image. We're going to have 150 square, no alignment. Oh, we're going to align them, align them left. In the Studio Press instructions, it says align them left. I don't know if it makes much difference if you don't align them at all. Um, now, content type. We want to show no content. We're just showing the image. No post title, no info, just the image. And then we're going to click the Save button. And if we have a look at our page, it's this section here. Refresh the page. And these will be featured images. I'm using the demo content, which doesn't actually include images. They're just placeholder uh, images. Um, but if you had images on your site if you'd attached images to your posts click one of these and it'll take us to the relevant post now if you look down I will we'll, um, edit this this post and you can see what a featured image is so when you make your post this is a peanut butter cup pie post when we make the post there's a section that says featured image and click that link there and it'll let you add a featured image and that's how you get the effect of those little boxes at the bottom down at the bottom of the site six little boxes in a row that's how you do that